unique teaching resources. I'm here to introduce my book report project, and I want you and your students to blast off with excitement with the book report projects that I'm going to introduce you to here. They come in all shapes and sizes. They're very unique and different from any other templates because they are large and in the shapes of different themes. Besides the shape of the project, you also have a grading rubric that will help you, a first draft response page for the students to edit their work before they get into a final draft, posters that are included, and in some projects, awards for finishing your project, and thematic clip art. I hope that you blast off and have some wonderful book report projects that you use from unique teaching resources. This is Heidi McDonald signing off from Cape Canaveral Space Center in Florida. Hello, my name is Heidi McDonald and I want to welcome you to the book report section of my website. I'm here in my office at home and this is where I do all of my work. I even have a bulletin board where I practice with what the displays will look like. The first thing you need to know is you're not going to need a lot of different materials to assemble these projects. You're going to need a glue stick, a pair of scissors, some coloring material, and some tape, and that is all that you're going to need in order for your students to complete these projects. The first project that I want to show you is my Rocket Book Report. All of the themes are different from my book reports, and so are the writing responses. For example, on this book report, one of the responses is why it was a blast to read this book. All of my book report projects come with a matching five-page banner. I know that it takes teachers a lot of time to do their bulletin board displays, so I hope that by providing you a banner for your bulletin board that this saves you valuable teaching time. Here's an example of my cheeseburger book report, and in it, each layer of the cheeseburger, the cheese, the meat, the lettuce, the tomato, is a different layer of the book, and the students draw a picture in the bottom bun. They think that this book report is very yummy. All of my book reports come with resources such as a direction sheet that shows you how to assemble the project. They come with first draft templates. Your students should begin by writing on the first draft sheets, not on the final draft shape templates. All of my first drafts, the line spaces that are provided, match exactly with the final draft. All of my book reports come with a grading rubric on them, and they are unique because I have my students grade their projects as well as myself. The students color in the little face for the grade that they think they deserve, and then there's a little spot for the teachers to circle the number. The evaluation is it's excellent, very good, good, or developing. Here is an example of my main character vacation suitcase book report, and this is a research project where the students have to pick a country that they would like to go and visit with the main character. They find out about the currency, the languages, the flag, and even how much it would cost to fly there. Some of the responses would be why it was fun to travel with the main character, what they had to pack in their suitcase. This is my game board book report, and it's set up like a Monopoly game where the students have to come up with names for the property titles based on the different settings and locations in their book. They also have to write 15 questions and answers for their trivia cards. For my birthday cake book report, the students enjoy planning a birthday party for the main character. They have to think about what kind of gifts the main character would enjoy getting, what kind of games, and the guests they should invite to this party. There's a little flip book here where students will write different information about the setting and the characters. So on this third layer of it is a little booklet. I have a school bus book report, and on this, students are using their sequencing skills of writing the beginning, the middle, and the end of the book. There's a place for their illustrations on each, and the doors of the school bus open to reveal a character. 
My mobile phone book report is a unique book report because it's both front and back, so it's ideal to hang on your ceiling. On this book report, students do text messages. They call their friends to recommend this book. I have a movie camera book report, and on this, the students pretend that they are a director and making a film version of their book. They have to pick where they want to film the movie, and also in the lens part, they write which famous actors they're going to have star in their movie. On the same concept, I have a camera book report, and they draw in the frame there, and there is writing space here. I have a computer-shaped book report. The students draw a picture on the computer screen, and then in the hard drive area, they write letters to the main character at www.maincharacter.com, and they explain why they would like to save a copy of this book to read later on their hard drive. I have a radio-shaped book report, and on this one here, it's also like a flip book. The speakers have a picture on it, but underneath each speaker is the writing space. On this book report, the students write song lyrics for their book. I have a character house book report, and on this, the door and the windows open up to reveal characters. The students for this book report write why it would be fun to live in the same house as their main character. Along the similar theme, I have a barn shape book report. At the end of the year, I have my students decide what was their favorite book that they read during that year, and they decide to give that book a gold cup award and why it was their favorite. I have a lot of different animal shapes. I'll only show you a few. This is my butterfly book report. And all of my banners I've custom designed with the theme of that particular shape. This is the banner that goes with the butterfly book report. I have turtle shapes, caterpillar shapes, dolphin shapes, snakes, and a lot of other different animals. I have a larger copy of a wanted poster, a star book report, a character wheel book report, and a main character body book report. This is a book report on Willy Wonka from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Students choose adjectives and they write them on the outside of the body and then on the inside of their body in the vest part is where they would do their written responses, why this is their favorite character and why they would enjoy meeting this person. One more example of a body book report. This is Mr. Twit from the book The Twits by Royal Dahl. I hope that this video has given you some ideas of what the book report projects on unique teaching resources are like and that your students have a blast doing them and that they blast off with reading this year. Thank you so very much.